Today I want to talk about YouTube University and what that is and how you should use it to your advantage. Alright, so YouTube University is a term to talk about how YouTube has replaced our education system. Our education system. Um, more and more um, practical knowledge is more important than college and even grad school. A lot of times, um, as we went through law school up to this point, we know basically how much practical knowledge we got from law school. There wasn't much really, didn't really teach you much about how to run a practice, how to, how to you know, start a business, um, how to, you know, uh, how to run a virtual law firm. Um, I've been able to get most of my education uh, through YouTube. Um, I do also read books. I have my book is here. You know, um, in the beginning, I would read a lot of books, and I still do, but even more than that, uh, I, I really focused on learning as much as I can from YouTube. So that's what YouTube University is, is being able to use YouTube to learn um, uh, as much as possible. Um, so I want to give some practical advice about YouTube, uh, YouTube University. So because YouTube uh, has so much content, it's very easy to be get flooded um, with so much videos. So first thing you want to do um, is you want to make sure to subscribe to very relevant uh, channels um, that you're interested about so you know you all you could you just YouTube search it for a certain topic and subscribe to it and over time um, you'll get very 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 relevant uh, videos in your subscription pay, uh, homepage um, and you know that's the first step so I think I'm probably subscribed to probably at least a thousand YouTube channels and I've probably unsubscribed more than I subscribe to um, so at this point, it's like the 80-20 uh, principle, applying it to only be subscribed to the YouTube channels that I really get the most value from. Um, so, you know, subscribing is free. So subscribe to as many as you can. And over time, if you see that the videos are about entertainment or things that are not as applicable to you, go ahead and unsubscribe. Um, and then, um, second part is that now, now you have all the YouTube channels that you could watch. It's very easy to get flooded with an influx of information um, and you know just be a consumer but that's not really the way to go um, I've been you know I made this mistake where I would just consume 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 um, you know apply uh, about 20% of the time consume 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 apply um, instead ideally you whenever you have a problem then at that point that you want to seek out that information so whenever you have a problem just search for it so instead of being a consumer on YouTube be the int intently go and find that content and that's going to help you fix that situation fix that problem that you have at that time that's like that's a higher level of learning and using youtube is using it intently instead of just being a consumer whatever that's in your in your youtube uh subscriber uh page so you know um consume with intent don't just consume because it's out there and then the other thing you want to do is is create playlists for yourself and go back to those playlists and review and learn those things. Um, so, you know, I have different playlists for so many different things. Um, I will, um, if you guys want uh, it, the link to all my favorite videos, I have videos that are favorited that are, uh, that are about marketing, about business, financial, productivity, things like that. I'll be happy to share these videos. Uh, let's just say when it comes to, let's say business, <clears throat> Pretty much, um, they're ranked by most recently added, and really these are the best of the best video business videos that I that I've pretty much seen and and have watched on YouTube. Um, so I'll be happy to share that with you guys. So definitely use YouTube. Oh, one other thing that I forgot. Um, there's a Chrome plugin called uh, Video Speed Controller. Um, it's a plugin on Chrome. So if you just search Video Speed Controller uh, Chrome. And install it for your for your browser and what it helps you do is it helps you speed up the videos by just pressing uh, a couple of uh, keyboard things so let's say D as you can see over here it goes up by point one so why you can't do the things that you really want to do like you might sit down at your computer at your desk and you're like right today I'm gonna get and also you'll be able to slow it down as you know as slow as you want so for every video uh, depending on how fast they speak, you'll be able to speed it up to the exact degree that you want it to speed up. Usually, I think at this point, I average like 1.8 or so. 
um, I consume at 1.8 and over time as more and more you do this actually your speed goes up you'll be able to you know, go from 1.9 2.0 and be able to learn at two times the speed and at this point I don't think I could even learn anything on any, on 1.0 I just it's like too slow for, for my brain um, so definitely use this you'll be able to learn faster you don't have to sit there um, you know you could get to the you know watch if you see if you see that you really need to pay attention or you know it's really important then you can slow it down and you know really pay attention but a lot of times you'll be able to consume and learn a lot faster by speeding it up um, of course comprehension really matters so just keep that in mind but uh, it really does help to learn faster um, if you guys like this video please like it um, I'm looking to add more lawyer entrepreneurs to this group so if you know any uh, lawyer entrepreneurs definitely invite your friends and if you guys have any questions let me know talk to you guys soon